This is my birthday gift. It is the Jaclyn Hill palette. Look at these colors. Look at that blue and that green. Now I think those are matte. And then these are shimmering. Jaclyn Hill is a um, YouTuber. Pretty sure she is. These are matte. I like that there's a combination of matte and shimmery. Very, very pretty. Hey y'all. It's Friday. And um, hold on. I got a package. It's Friday and I'm ready to swing. Not in the mood. <clears throat> Not in the mood, girl. If you hear any background noise, it stormed like crazy um, two days ago and the trees are everywhere. Look, Rhonda, I can tell that you really have, have settled in Arizona because I don't like the storms. I don't like the weather, um, the monsoon season, I should say. I don't like it because when you are in the house, not even just that, the trees are everywhere in our, in our neighborhood. They're all laid out. And so now our neighbor's third backyard is a mess. Their front yard was a mess. So they have landscapers there, um, cutting down, breaking down the trees so that they could get rid of them. It's Friday and the reason why you're seeing me is because we haven't done anything. I thought that my husband would want to go and do stuff on the weekday, but it looks like he just wants to sit at home and chill. I'm not complaining, but I wish you would have would have let me know, Playboy. That's what you wanted to do, was just sit home and chill and not really do anything. So yesterday when I picked up JB and we got home, um, you know, Saturday we're going to go out to eat. But, sorry, earlier yesterday, my husband's like, well, maybe he'll be okay if we all go out to eat. Because I told him, I said, JB can't go out to eat with us anymore. Because now that Wanda's going to be there, that's an audience, and he's going to kind of show out. So we, we were like, cool. Well, then yesterday, he changed his mind. He's like, I think he'll be okay. I'm like, nope. Sorry, I thought that was him. I'm like, you need to listen to me. You, he would not be okay. Child, and and not only that, but it's three adults out having having drinks and having dinner. He needs to go somewhere, so he finally agreed. So anyway, when I picked up JB, he was like, "So what do you want to do, JB, on Sunday?" I'm like, "Why are we asking JB what he wants to do? This is our birthday weekend." Shit. Then I figure, okay, I see what he wants to do. He wants to do stuff as a family, y'all. And I'm like, Vivian. Calm your ass down. So, I, but this is what I was thinking. I, I wasn't saying this out loud. So, JB wants to go to what the hell is this? Oh, it's my husband's birthday present. <laughs> JB wants to go to the train museum. So that's what we'll do. Hey man, won't he do it? My Amazon stuff came in. Hold on, y'all. Let me go ahead. I'm gonna have to break down these boxes. See. Y'all, when my husband is here, y'all think that JB be all over here for me? When my husband is here, JB pays me dust. Oh. I'm not gonna cry, y'all. I've been emotional, I'm gonna tell you why. Happy birthday, Vivian. No, it says, hi, Vivian, happy birthday. Hope you have a day filled with happiness and love. Smiley face T. Oh, this is so cute. So let me show y'all what I got. And depending on what it is, I may wear it. Ooh, Shamarista Illuminator Highlight. Yes, ma'am. That's cute. So this is one of my subscribers who sent me a gift, y'all. I got the Chrome Metallic Highlighter Illuminator. Thank you for that. And then I got the baby skin pores i needed this sis you know the holy spirit is definitely speaking to you <laughs> thank you for that glitter and like a chrome i may need to look at a video oh lid liner and lash oh hell yeah we're we gonna be using this we're gonna be using this tomorrow night she's probably thinking you are crazy as hell <gasps> girl you did not just send me this you did not just you know what you need to send me your information so I can send you a pound cake. She bought me the cute dad. This thing is like, I, I would never buy it because I said it's too much. Let me go ahead and open up this now. Thank you so much, T. And I will be reviewing this. 
She gonna wrap this, they gonna wrap this up in a Ziploc bag. What is this, y'all? Okay, okay, okay. Okay, so this is, I'm not gonna do anything else. This is the Baba Su by Albaya. I still have that international giveaway coming up and honey, you will be getting this. So let me go ahead and put this back in here. So let me tell you real quick about uh, some raw African shea butter. So my husband, yes, uh, two days ago, he was like, you know, I was watching these videos. I told you, my husband is a man of little words, but when he wants to talk, I listen. I'm like, okay, he saw some videos about what He was like, you know, I was watching this video of some African Americans who went over to Ghana and they were selling something called, they were getting something called shea butter. Do you know what that, I'm like, do you not realize that I am a natural hair YouTuber? I am a walking bar of shea butter, a walking jar of shea. Yeah, I know what shea butter. Do I know what shea butter? <laughs> so anyway, I got some shea butter, but he sent me another video. I accidentally deleted it. I need to have him send it, send it to me again. There are a couple, and this has been happening for a long time, but there are plenty of African Americans who are moving back to the motherland, purchasing land, opening up their own businesses. Um, and a lot of people actually go over there, get resources like shea butter, come back over here and sell it. So he was like, maybe you should do that. I'm like, can we focus on moving back to Texas? We, 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 we ain't gonna move back to Africa, not anytime soon, but calm, calm your nerves, but. Okay, so cute. All right, so this is my girdle I got. Bottom solutions, girl, yes, we do need it. So this is a tummy to thigh, almost like Spanx, but it doesn't go as far. You know, the Spanx sometimes can go down past your calves or to your calves, but this doesn't. This just goes to my knees, which is good. So I'm gonna try this on later on. And then I have some vitamin E oil to help out with the scars. Some, um, Vitamin D, that still helps out with the scars, but that's for my um, immune system, teeth, health, muscles. And this, this is so cute. Let me put this back here. This is that inflatable booster seat I was telling you about that's gonna be great for traveling. Now this feels, this looks a lot bigger than I, when I thought it would be, but that's okay. I'm gonna test this out to see how this goes isn't this adorable and last but not and let's and then this right here is my clutch that i purchased for um my high school reunion banquet i want to see what this looks like does it go up like that okay girl what can i put in here my phone keys a package of cigarettes i don't smoke um this is what it looks like this is pretty and one of the reasons why i got it because it crisscrosses and if you remember my dress it has like a, an effect of crossing over so i think this will be real nice a pop of color to all of the pink i'm wearing and the champagne shoes and the blue uh earrings my earrings are blue um icy blue this is cute all right let me put well, on here's everything i'm gonna be using to make my lemon cake now it's really hard for me to do measurements you guys because i switch up the recipe as i am cooking so but you can see everything here that is listed and yes that is three sticks of butters that is for the actual cake and for the icing because i will be making a buttercream lemon icing so starting off with the cake we have one and a half um boxes of the cake mix just one and a half boxes a half of the pudding and then i'm gonna go ahead go ahead and mix this up now i use about one and a half cups of buttermilk to a half a cup of water but again playing around with the measurements as i am cooking um added one and a half sticks of the milk butter and i like to add my eggs one other time add one egg mix one egg mix four eggs there then i have um some lemon zest about one tablespoon then we have the um lemon asterisk and the vanilla about one tablespoon of each now this is going to go in the oven at 365 until done about 35 40 minutes for the buttercream one and a half sticks of softened butter you want to mix this minimum the butter alone alone five minutes then adding the powdered sugar two and a half cups to three cups of powdered sugar and then last but not least adding juice of one lemon some lemon asterisk and vanilla asterisk mixing that again for a good three minutes i also added one tablespoon of half and half um this was a very very light buttercream 
frosting. These are my cakes. They're done. And now I'm going to take one layer and spoon on half of the mixture. This went into 9 inch cake pans. Everything will be a little bit different if you're using your typical 8 inch. Um... I made a mistake in that my cakes were not completely cooled off. When you are using buttercream, homemade buttercream frosting, because it is made with butter, you want to ensure that it's completely cooled, chilled before frosting. I didn't do that, and so what happened is that the icing, the layer here, the icing started to seep through. But that's okay. That's okay. I used that, whatever seeped through at the bottom, I used that to frost the bottom of the cake. Um, this is a top layer, flipping it over because I want it flat. And what I did is I um, candied some of the lemon zest by boiling it. Um, excuse me, I used a vegetable peeler to peel a little, a little bit of the lemon and then I boiled it in some sugar water and then I rolled it in some extra sugar to make the lemon zest on top. And I ended up cutting up some limes, excuse me, some lemons and decorating the bottom. So this is what it looks like, a little messy, but it was so good. Who you think you're talking to? I spent time alone, love it for me. These days, something like a dream, since I've been on the road. Seeing shit I've never seen before, and still there's no place like home. Spending all the days on the west side. It don't feel the same on the other side now. Young niggas switching up the program. I'm tired of doing the research for you. I've been on it since I was here. Bet you're not gonna go so far, you're not gonna go so far. But I'm not gonna go so far, you're not gonna go so far. Who you think you're talking to? I'm not gonna go so far, you're not gonna go so far. But I'm not gonna go so far. I've been done with this one, she's been running a fool Been on this one, I'm gonna create my own Spending all my days on the west side now It don't feel the same on the other side now Young niggas switching up the room really now Trying to put some love on my own hands right now I ain't looking for the bitches out just right now I'm gonna be in my own bullshit. 